Sarah from The Upcoming. Such a pleasure to meet you. So how did you go about preparing for this role? It's such an ambitious film based on the novel, completely different world. How did you prepare? Oh, I am... Um, I, well, I started by reading the script I started, and then wrote the, uh, read the book. I didn't write the book. Um, read the book and, um, and then just tried to imagine how it is to be Hester Shaw, how it is to have gone through the trauma she has, how it is to live, live with that and, and that physical deformity like she has that reminds her constantly of what happened and to be isolated as much as she is in life and, and not to kind of know how to communicate with human beings and, 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 and then how do you grow from that? How do you move on from that? And so it was a, it was a challenge, but a, an exciting one. And, you know, you've got Peter Jackson writing and producing, Christian Rivers directing, amazing cast. But it's, you know, a lot of CGI having to come in at the end. So what was your experience actually of making the film? It was great. I mean, we had so many beautiful sets and um, I, I, it, we really didn't have to imagine too much. I had to like imagine maybe London, big London moving towards me, but otherwise, you know, we had Airhaven built up that hung from the ceiling in one of the studios. We had all the airships um, built and they moved around and scuttlebutt and all these things. So it was just a very pleasant experience and exciting and, and, and all the artists involved in this movie just gave so much to it that you weren't left alone to imagine something just by with a green screen, you know. And it's not just entertainment, it's kind of got a philosophical aspect to it as well, and your character's kind of badass, so, you know, what do you think people will take away? I don't know, I hope that, you know, first of all, I just hope they will enjoy it, and if it leaves them thinking a bit about the world we live in and, and the choices we make and what we want in life, then that's great. Oh, yeah, it was, um, I think Hester Shaw is such a cool character. She's, Philip Reeve wrote her in such a creative, I mean, she's just a multi-dimensional character and a real human being, you know, and so often female characters just happen not to be written like that, and I, I, it's very just refreshing to read someone like her and then to play someone like her and hopefully for people to see someone like her um, yeah so that that was one thing and then to, just to work with people like Peter Jackson and Fran Walsh and Philip Boyens and then Christian Rivers on his first debut was just great I know a phenom phenomenal sets like you know a city that hung from the air and uh, you know, like scuttlebutt that moves in different ways and airships that actually moved and it, it was it was really great. It was like an amusement park.